Well, you two, this is the castle. Or at least what's left of the blooming thing. I want to go and see this uh, Ronnie Shore, although... One thing I am curious about is this... This new tape I found... From the Mechanist. People of the Commonwealth, it is I, the Mechanist. I come to warn you of a new scourge who stalks the innocent and destroys my robot allies who only seek to save lives. This scourge cares nothing for the progress we have made, but we will find him and bring him to justice. Oh. I think they're referring to me. Well, anyway, that was a... Wow, that was a fair trek down. Would have been tempting to... Have a look at that place over here. I really want to get this castle up and running. I want to get... Uh, I want to get rid of this institute, but I can't do it until... Uh, the Minutemen are fully ready. At least on the plus side, we managed to call in the County Crossing and got that place going. So hopefully they can start building their defences as well. But, uh... Let's go see who this Ronnie Shore is and what they want. Ah, so this is Ronnie Shore. Hello? Yeah, there you are. Finally. I've been waiting to talk to you. Um... So you sound like Ronnie Shaw, so I take it you're Ronnie Shaw, the, uh, the woman I heard on the radio? Now who else would I be? Can't mistake me for one of those pups you got running things around here. Eh, okay. I used to be with the Minutemen myself. Back before Joe Becker got himself killed and the idiots took over. Oh, right. Um, I think I've heard of Joe Becker. Who's that again? That's just sad. General Becker used to run ah, the yes. Minutemen. The last real leader we ever had. Yes. After he died, there wasn't anybody left with the guts and brains to pull things together. Got ya. Okay, so... Um... So what is it actually you, you, you want from me, though? Heard you were trying to get the Minutemen back on their feet. Mm -hmm. Thought I'd come see the new general for myself. Okay. So what's your story? What makes you think anybody even wants the Minutemen back? Well... After what I've seen in this... Wasteland. All the raiders, all the gunners, super mutants. Someone's got to do something. The Commonwealth, they need the Minutemen back. And people are starting to realise that. I've heard some good things. Wouldn't be here otherwise. Now that I'm here, I can see you really need my help. Well, are you offering to rejoin? I guess I am. But first things first. I'm probably the only one who still remembers this. Mm -hmm. but the castle's armory was located in the West Bastion. All of our best equipment was stored in there. Weapons, ammo, schematics, you name it. Oh, Come hey. on, I'll show you. Ah, right, okay, cool. Oh, um, um, this could be a problem. Um, ah, good. Looks like it might still be intact. All right. The door's still sealed. Bastion hasn't collapsed. Right. The trick now is finding a way in. Okay, um... You any idea? I mean, do you know somewhere to open the door? No. And even if we could blast it open, we'd probably destroy what's inside while we're at it. Right. If you can't go through, go around. Let's have a look at the Northeast Bastion. Okay. I think I was hallucinating there. Well... We'll do that, I'm just going to get some water if you don't mind. I'm really thirsty. Right, so, what, we're going here? Things are a bit crowded. A few more beds would lift everyone's spirits. Okay, I'll, I'll bear that in mind. Ah, there's Preston. This was Glad you made it, Preston. Quarters used to be a tunnel leading from here to the armory. Hmm. Uh, blocked by this rubble. We'll have to find some way to clear it. Okay. 
Got you, right. Well, it's gonna be back breaking, but I'm just so hungry all the time. Well, I've got a, a trader running, bringing food here. So, uh, I mean, don't worry. I mean, we'll get this place up and running shortly, anyway. Stay sharp. Don't let your guard down. Yeah. Right. So, Come well, on, General, you must have some way to clear this rubble. Yeah, I, th I think I do, but it's gonna it's gonna take a while. I don't exactly want to start running, uh, you know, throwing mines or something at it. I think it's just gonna be a case of, well, just gonna have to dig it out. Well, that's the plan. We'll dig it out. Hmm. Don't know where Ruddy's wandered off to, but. Where did she wander off to? Well, never mind. No, this place is cleared. We've got to head down here. I can take it. Come on, you lot. Yeah, oh, sign of the minute, man. No idea where she's gone. Ooh, mines. Be careful, there are mines around. If I had access to uh, a vacuum modification, here. I could make Yeah, I was gonna say there are mines down here, Ronnie. You okay? Better let me go first, uh I've got a decent uh Lamp here, at least I can probably see better. Must be down here somewhere. Oh, there's a mine. Wow, this is an old place. Oh, Struth. Hang on, hang on. Oh. oh that was that was a tad close. Take it somebody sealed this place off for a good reason. It must have blown up the uh, the entrance back there and collapse it. Oi oi oi. Oh, another mine. Yeah, I think they must have Collapse that place for a reason. Hmm. I can see a mine around the corner. It's quite useful stuff down here, mine, you know, Ronnie. Oh, more mines. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on, back up, back up, back up, back up. We've got a robot sentry here. Well, I'll be. I would have never guessed the Sarge would still be down here. Don't worry, it's one of ours. Oh, okay. What? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! I thought you said he was on our side. What the heck? Ada? Oh, come on. Come on, Ada. Dog means taking all the brunt of this. Get ready, that thing's gonna blow, Ada. Ah, sorry about that, dog meat. You okay there, buddy? Oh, look at all the blood. Ooh, that's bad. Oh. Know this password. One if I land. Nah, that's not it. For the Commonwealth. Ah, darn it. Oh, it's been a long time. United we stand. 
<laughs> yeah, that was it. Yeah. Yes, sir. Ain't it? I think I've got. I might have picked up some missiles or something. Picked up something and it's just totally weighing me down now. Uh, what else did I pick up? Hmm. How much of this stuff can you carry? Oh, good. Come on. Oh. Oh dear. This looks to be. Um. Ah, that explains all the landmines. This is, well, was General McGann. He had your job back when I first joined up. Must have Aye. gotten trapped down here when that sea beast attacked the castle. Uh, he did manage to keep the armory secure. I'll give him that much. Ah, guess the uniform is yours now, if you want it. This old geezer doesn't need it anymore. Rest in peace, General. Your fight is done, and the Minutemen live on. Hmm. <laughs> There's no point in getting all sentimental about something that happened 40 years ago. Come on, 40. we're almost through. Well, hang on a minute. Let me just have a look on this uh, terminal, if you don't mind. All right. So he sealed himself in, locked up the armory, and sealed himself in. If you find any spare parts, you be sure and let me know. Is there a reason the hairs on your neck are standing up like that? I'm sure. That looks weird. I wonder if that person was buried alive in there. Let's move on. Come on. Where next then, Ronnie? Glad you turned up, Ronnie. Ooh, some seriously good stuff here. Excellent. The armory well, still intact. Muskets. Everything we need, just waiting for us. And the cream of the crop: schematics for building artillery. Okay. Bean split a mark. So what? You, did, did you see artillery? Great big guns blow up our enemies from miles away. Yeah. Any of this ringing a bell? Well, All right. yeah. Grab that schematic and let's get going. Don't forget to grab some smoke grenades too. Um. Okay. Smoke grenades. Well, may as well clear this place out while I'm here. I'll have to clear the rest of it out later. It's not the priority like. Anything and everything I'll grab for now. And we'll go and see what... Uh, ooh. Ooh. Wow, this place is seriously well stocked. Um, uh, I'll put them into the storage. Let's see what I can leave here. I, mean, I think most of the weight's going to be that, uh, that fat man. 
Oh, there's Ronnie over there. Oh, it's flame of fuel, is that? What's that doing on the floor? Right, I'm gonna offload all this stuff, then we'll go and see Ronnie. Right, so that's good. That should help. Uh, that should help the folks here. Hmm. I'll leave them here. Yeah, leave them there. Offload them. Yeah, definitely don't need them. Right, come on, let's go see Ronnie. See what you put there, uh, what she wants us to do. So what next then, Ronnie? Ah, looks like you've got everything we need. As soon as you get some artillery built, we'll do a test fire to calibrate it. Uh, um. Okay. Well, you heard her. We need to build an artillery. Hmm, that's, that's not bad. I mean, uh, certainly an interesting design. be interesting to see what one of these are like, I must admit, but... Come on, let's go see Runny. It's getting dark anyway. We'll, uh, go see what she's got to say now, then. General. Hello. There you go, Ronnie. We've got your artillery up and running. Ah, gosh darn, it's good to see artillery here again. So here's the thing about the big guns. They can't fire at anything too close. But right. the range is impressive. That's what the smoke grenades are for. Oh, for right. Bad guys. Right. If we have artillery in range, we'll confirm over the radio and target our fire on your smoke. Right. But first, we better do a test fire. Make sure we're hitting what we're aiming at. Okay, fair enough. That makes sense. So you see that little building over there? We'll use that for our aiming point. Right. Keep your radio on and tuned to Radio Freedom so we can confirm we're ready. Okay. Uh, right. I just want to... Alright, General, if you can hear me, we're ready. Toss one of those smoke grenades into the target area and we'll start the test fire. Right. Ah, you got to love the irony. It's exactly what we're about to do. Okay. Now what? Okay, we've got your smoke on the target. Right. Might want to stand back. Yeah, you know, just in case. Right. Um. Um. My right counter is spiking. We may want to move. Whoa! Truth. Um. I think we only want to get behind this truck here. Holy moly. <laughs> These things are brutal. I wouldn't want to be around when one of these things come at you. Struth. Are you done yet? That look good from here. You've now got artillery support. Use it wisely, General. Brilliant. 
Right, come on you two. Let's go and have a chat with Preston. So what do you I think? I hand it to you, General. You really turned things around for the Miniman. I never thought I'd see the day that the Miniman had artillery support again. It's brilliant. We'll see about building them at all our settlements to expand our coverage. Got you. And Ronnie Shaw returns. Wow, she's something else, isn't she? Uh, yeah. I mean, I mean, I'm, I'm just impressed. She seems to be the only one who like remembered exactly, you know, that, you know, when this was the HQ and. She knew about the old armory, she knew about the artillery and everything. I mean, it's just brilliant. I'd heard stories about her from the old timers, but I didn't know she was still around. The fact that she's come back to the Miniman means we must be doing something right. I'll yeah. let you know if I hear of any settlements that need our help. In the meantime, make sure to offer help to anyone that needs it. That can only help our cause. Okay, well, you keep an eye on this place, will you? Now, what I'm interested in is I've picked up a key from that, uh, well, now deceased general. I'm quite interested to see uh, see what's left of his his headquarters. We had a good supply of clean water. Things would be pretty good. You do. There's a there's a functioning water uh, thing out there. There's a pump as well. Yeah. I thought there was no water. Now Ronnie was talking about the quarters over here. Here, what's this? Uh. Ooh. Oh. Oh, oh truth. Wow. Protect the people at a minute's notice. This is just awesome. So I've got my own little place here. Nice. Oh, look at the bed. Oh. Oh. Refrigerator. Oh. Drinkable water. The cooking stove I can use. So I can keep all my bits and bobs in the fridge, all that lovely food. Excuse me a minute, can I, can I just squeeze past there, Raider? Um, I, I just want to squeeze past there. A washer, a dryer. Hee <laughs> hee! Oh, the toilet. Toilet paper! Oh, I even get a bath and a shower. Oh, this is just brilliant. Uh, can, can I just squeeze past? What, what time is it? Right. First order of the day, I think, is... Well, I'm going to get some sleep. And I think, Ada, what we'll do is we'll get this... We need to get this place properly sorted out. And then what we'll do is, I think, uh, we'll then head over to University Point, clear it out for the railroad. Now, wow, truth, that's a heck of a distance we're going to have to go for you here. We're going to have to go all the way over to Fort Hagen Satellite Array, find this other robo brain. But I think it's got to be worth it. The only trouble is, I think the Institute might be getting a bit twitchy. Um, because there's supposed to be some uh, since held up at Bunker Hill. Well, I'll tell you what, here's the plan. I'm going to get some sleep. I'm then going to work with Preston to get this, this castle up and running. And then you, me, and Dogmeat are going to go over to clear out University Point. And then we're going to 
We're gonna go over there. Well, hmm. I think we better go and focus on this courser. I know you wanna deal with this mechanist quickly, but while we're in the area, I think we'll we'll deal with this courser. And I want to check out this Warwick homestead because there's supposedly somebody there who's been replaced by a synth. But anyway, seeing as I'm now the general, I better start looking the part. Pop a stim pack there. Oh, it's true. Carrying too much doesn't do me any favours. Yeah, looks a bit better. Right, I'm going to get some sleep. I'll see you all in the morning. Well, I've got to say, I mean, we're getting off to a good start here. Still this uh, wall here that needs uh, shoring up. That one over there, at least it's blocked off a bit now. I mean, there's a lot to do, but it's a, it's a start. So hopefully Bob will be able to make sure this place is properly defended and whatnot. Just need to buy him some time. So at least I've had some sleep anyway, so the plan really is to have a bit of a visit around here. Where we'll be going next is to University Point, because the railroad want me to visit there and clear it out. I don't know what's going on there, but I think that's that was in relation to Randolph, I think it was. Yeah, Randolph's safe house. Hmm. Okay. So we'll do that. I also have a courser down here to clear out. That's what Pam wanted me to do. Just go, oh, just take out a courser, she says. I'm definitely intrigued to visit this Warwick homestead where this uh, synth supposedly been replaced. I'm definitely, definitely interested in meeting this Roger Warwick or Warwick. But we will get round to uh, helping you, Ada. Hopefully, we'll find this other Robo brain over here. Sounds like we're going to have to take on the, the Rust Devils at their headquarters, clear them out. Presumably find this robo brain. I, mean, I don't know whether it's attacking them or what. <clears throat> but at some point I'm, I need to get out of this uh, down to Virgil. I promise to bring back bring him back a serum. But first things first, we need to head over to University Point and clear it out. Yeah, we've got a plan. <laughs>